Frank, I know you want me to dump the Jenna stuff, but I'm not going to do it, so cheer up. Pop, all the stuff that's going on with you right now isn't the only thing going on in my life right now. I got my own set of problems, OK? Can I help? I don't know. You know, I, I don't know what I'm going to do with Natalia and the baby and everything else. I want to do the right thing, but how is this all going to work? It's simple, Frank. You're going to be the dad. She's going to be the mom. How, Pop? She's, she lives somewhere else with the baby. I'm going to be living somewhere else. What does that do to everyone, Frank, to me, to the baby? It Come happens on. all the time, Frank, nowadays. Parents don't always live together. I don't know if... Sorry. Hi. Hi. Sorry. No. Why? What? I just... No, Come on in. Come on in. Hello. It's okay. Hello. Hi. Hi, Natalia. Don't worry. Bye, Frank. Yeah. Hi. Hi. Um, how are you? I'm okay. Good. You look nice. Thanks. Um, I just want to let you know I spoke to Lillian, and uh, she recommended a really good doctor. So I have an appointment in a couple days. I just wanted to let you know. All right. Thank you. And this is actually uh, the name of the doctor and the time and the, and the date and everything, you know, if you wanted to come with me. You don't have to, but I just wanted you to know that you're invited. You know, you're, you're always going to be invited. Well, I appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you very much. Will Olivia be there? I don't know. I, I hope so. I'm going to ask her. OK. I'll, I'll let you know. Okay. Do you have a problem with Olivia being there? I'm not sure. I'm not sure that I want you and Olivia to raise our baby. Hey, Kira. Kira, who sent the flowers? I hope these flowers are as beautiful as you are. Love, Natalia. Oh, oh my. <gasps> Those are beautiful. <clears throat> well, you have an admirer. Oh. I, I just don't really want them in my office, so I was trying to figure out the best place to put them. Oh, they're so beautiful. If you don't want them, give them to somebody who needs cheering up. You don't need cheering up. You went out and took care of yourself, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> I went a little overboard, but it's just that I I have a date, and um, I didn't know what to wear, so you got a date? With Billy. I mean, it's a little... I don't need to be nervous about a date with Billy, but I guess we all have somebody like that in our lives. Somebody who just makes us do crazy things like go out and buy a whole bunch of dresses that we don't need. <laughs> Did you need the chocolate chips? It's the last one. I was going to make some cookies. Oh, me too. You were? Yeah. I, actually, you know what? It's fine. You take the chocolate chips. I can use some peanut butter. Oh, no, 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 no. You're pregnant. You're pregnant. Yes. Congratulations. I am. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> no, when I was pregnant, I craved pineapple upside down cakes. So mm. luckily I bake. You take those. Oh no, these are, actually these are not for me. So are these for you? No, they're not for me. They're for a friend. Oh, okay. Well, you know what we could do? Um, we could bake them together and then we'll use the peanut butter and the chocolate chips and our friends will get both. That's a great idea. Yeah. Definitely. You get the um, butter, I'll get the eggs. Okay, and you can just Follow me to my place, the big kitchen. You're on. Okay. <laughs> I make a ton of cookies all the time. There's a church community that I'm part of, mm -hmm. and once a month we take all these cookies to nursing homes and hospitals. It's actually really fun. You should come sometime. Mm -hmm. Sounds fun. Maybe I will. So is that why you're baking today? Uh, no, these are, uh, I'm making these for a friend. Oh. A friend. <laughs> yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's why you're making cookies, right? Yeah, yeah, I think so. I, I think he's my friend. You don't know if he's your friend? Well, it depends on what your definition of friend is. I mean, it's, are you saying friend or friend? <laughs> Which one do you want him to be? Well, I think I want him to be a friend. Yeah. <laughs> so that's why you're making him cookies. That is, and that's why you're making yours. Definitely. Uh -huh. <laughs> you need a bigger table for those flowers. I mean, the flowers are, are beautiful, but that's that's the problem. It's just it's not showing them off very well. Yeah. Well, no, I appreciate the the pointer. Mm -hmm. um, I've I've just been wondering about this. Uh, did you know 
that Natalia was pregnant when she left? You know, Natalia's life, it, it's her business. That's kind of a convenient answer, Blake. Natalia's my employee. She's also my friend. And if she confided something about her life to me, she asked me to keep it secret. And I just respected her wishes. I just don't understand. I don't get why she would come to you about something like this and not come to me. Because her life choices affect you. Just like your life choices affect her. That's what happens when you really love someone. But isn't that all the more reason she should have come to me in the first place? Well, sure, it should happen that way, but it doesn't always. And sometimes the last person in the world you can go to with the big stuff is, is the person that you love. And uh, I wouldn't worry about it. You two are going to work this out.